Good morning, guys. Uh, welcome here to day four here at Monterey Car Week. Uh, out here at the uh, NBC Suites. Picked up my press pass for Laguna Seca. Couple of cars here up at the uh, hotel. I got an Aventador SV that's right behind me. And then there's an older Ferrari that I don't know what it is. It is right hand drive though, so that's pretty sweet. Get a quick look right here. And then we have a Ferrari 308 behind that as well, so that's pretty sweet. Hey guys, so can you guess where I'm at? If you guessed Rimac, you're right. I'm at the Rimac house. And the noise you're hearing is the cooling fans of the Rimac Concept 1. Uh, the cooling fans are cooling it while it's supercharging right now. It's been driven a whole lot, so right now they're, they're cooling, you know, it's charging, so that's what it's cooling down. So I'm going to do a quick walk around of the car and just show you everything. It's really cool. So one thing to notice, you see how the shape of the key is? And then also, if we walk around, and if you see the shape on the side of the car, and it wraps all the way around the side, just to make it look like a tie, and what Rimac's doing is going to, that, that's their brand, that's their branding. And every one of their cars is going to have that shape to it, um, which is really remarkable. So to open the door, you come here, right behind, underneath of the mirror, and just press a button underneath it there. And that opens up the car. And you just take a quick peek of the screens on and seeing how everything looks. It just looks amazing. I've never seen one of these in person, but it really is great. So I'm just gonna give this one a close real quick and we can walk over to the bike. Well, a couple cool facts, it has 1,224 horsepower. Uh, it has four electric motors, one on each wheel, and they can actually all be used simultaneously, you know, independently and they can turn around it's called tank mode which is really sweet it's really innovative the concept one was created so they could just showcase exactly what they could do and what they were capable of uh, and they made they were supposed to make eight of them they made seven and they I don't know exactly what the issue with what you know why that was they told me don't remember <laughs> but uh, another thing they've come out with is this bike and it's the great and one thing with this is, is it's actually a hybrid of a bike and a motorcycle. It actually has an electric motor on it. I don't know all the logistics of this bike, so I'm not going to try to tell you something I don't know. Um, one thing I do know is if you walk up to this bike, and right here you put your different fingerprints on it, you know, the scanner that's right there, um, it gives you different driving modes and stuff like that. So that's really innovative. So um, you can still pedal the bike without the electric and you don't need your fingerprint for that but so but to be able to engage the electric motors that is what you have to do so I give once again a quick thank you to rib mock here for letting us to come out and check this all out Amen. and we'll continue with our day all right guys I have the concept 2 behind me look at that guys Wow It is. Yeah. yeah. You gotta get the back here, Phil. I know. This is Check out the champagne crazy. bottles. Are those actual champagne bottles? These we uh, CNC them. Oh, okay. Um, but it's just to show how far we can actually go and how much we can do with it. Do you have a lot of uh, orders for these already? Uh, some have been spoken for, yeah. Okay, and how many are you making? Uh, 150 units. Okay, very nice. Yeah. Any, any to the US so far? Uh, yeah, most of it. Okay, cool. US is like the biggest market. The biggest market for yeah, you guys. Yeah, it's a really good market for EV, especially in California. Yeah. Um, battery range. Check out the interior. Larger than 400 the miles. 400 miles. Okay. Yeah. Uh, with, with Champagne bottles and. Oh, well, with, yeah. With glasses are awesome, guys. A little careful. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, right. I mean, I love, I love the uh, the concept one, but this, this is a next, this is next level stuff right here. Does it have um, electrics to power the screens inside? Or? Uh, yeah, we didn't plug it in uh, yet. All right, guys. Uh, here at Gooding and Company, I'm just gonna do a quick uh, 
um, montage here of the cars that are around here. Um, you can see what's around. I'm just going to go around and take a quick video of everything here. Uh, one thing that is behind me now is a Veyron Legend Edition. Um, so that's pretty cool that I that I've seen. I've seen an older Bugatti, and I've seen older Corvettes, and there's Ferraris, and a bunch of other stuff. So I'll do a quick montage for you guys while we're here, alright? So uh, about ready to head out here. So you saw the quick montage. Uh, what was your favorite car inside that quick one of the montage? And here at uh, Getting in Company. Just let me know in the comments below. My personal favorite is the 63 split black uh, fuel. -y. All right, guys. Well, that's the end of the today's vlog. I uh, hope you enjoyed today. I uh, hope you continue to enjoy my coverage here at Car Week. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to the channel and also remember, I uh, get a thousand likes on this video before the 27th. I'll give away five t-shirts on my channel. So, you know, get to like him. By the way, you gotta be subscribed to the channel. So, thanks guys. Peace out. Peace.